Wesley, today is the day I've been dreaming of since the moment I met you. I'm so excited to see your handsome face waiting for me at the end of the aisle. I want you to know just how much I love you and how thankful I am to become a part of your family. We often talk about your dad and how we think he had a hand in putting us together. I know you wish more than anything he was here with you today and I truly believe that he is. He showed us yesterday this gift as a way to keep him close to you every step of the way today. Put his army handkerchief inside your jacket close to your heart and wear these cufflinks. So he'll be right there guiding your hand. P.S. Open them up. I love you and I can't wait to be your wife, Kelly. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today to witness the union of Kelly and Wesley in holy matrimony. Although the weather may not be as perfect as we would have preferred, it's still a beautiful day for a ceremony. And it's a great to see everybody out here to join us today. The bride and groom would like to thank all of you for being here because all of you have played important parts in bringing them to this moment. I was a lot younger than I am now. I thought that falling in love, getting married, and having a family was just something that automatically happened when you grew up. However, over the years I began to realize that finding my soulmate was not a given. I had pretty much prepared my heart that true love may be something that wasn't in the cards for me in this life. But then out of nowhere, a little twist of fate pointed me in a new direction. Exactly two years ago, when I visited the beach expecting to attend a concert that got canceled because of a tropical storm, <laughs> I wound up meeting you instead, and my life would be forever changed. The fact that I am standing here before you today is a true testament to what kind of man you are. When I was at my lowest and darkest in my life, I asked God not to bring someone into my life unless he was the right person. You told me that one of the last words your dad said to you was that he wanted you to find your soulmate as he had found in your mom. And I have no doubt that God and your dad were in cahoots the day that they brought us together. You've given me a life that I've always dreamed of. You've been patient and kind, but most of all, you've loved me completely and unconditionally without fail. I vow to be the best mother I can be to our son and vow that I'll spend every second that I have breath left in my body. Today marks the beginning of forever and there's no one else I'd rather spend it with than you. I promise to do everything I can to give you and Hudson a happy life. I love you, Kelly, and I'm the luckiest and happiest guy in the world today, and thank you for choosing me. By the power best in me, by the Universal Life Church, and by the state of Alabama, I pronounce you, Wesley and Kelly, as husband and wife, lawfully wedded before everyone here and God above. Wesley, you may kiss the bride. <laughs> Sometimes you win and 
sometimes you lose it Sometimes it calls you right in the move Come to my table, come to my bed Go easy my hunger, easy my head Bringing me fire, bringing me water Taking me high, taking me down It is my pleasure to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Wesley and Kelly Shearer.